hi vlog. That's not your intro. Hey everybody. <sighs> do you ever just feel like screaming? Because I do. Hey everybody, I'm G. If you don't know me, I hope you're here to learn more about me. Hey everyone, how are you? Oh my god, my hair looks like it's two different colors. Do you see that? This one's darker and this one's lighter. Um, so I guess I just like even, I didn't evenly disperse my gloss when I did it last time. It was like my first time ever trying it. So um, note to self, disperse it. Speaking of, I need to make a hair appointment for before graduation. I was just thinking about that. So let me put that on my to-do list really quick. Hold on. Now that that's on there, you can already tell from the title of this video what we're going to be talking about today. And it's actually a quick one. Um, it's a quick favorites video. I don't have too many. I'm trying to narrow down my favorites because my monthly favorites that is because I like watching them, but or I like watching everybody else's, but I'm also like, okay, give me like six things that I can like actually get my hands on versus giving me like 40 things that you're loving that like I'm gonna be obsessed with and then I can't buy all of them. So I'm giving you like six things, I believe it's six, one, two, three, four, five, six, yeah. Six things that I'm absolutely loving right now and most of them are pretty affordable, I wanna say. A couple like splurgy items, I guess, but um, yeah. I'm trying to I'm trying to be realistic with these favorites and not go, you know, go a little not go too wild with them the way other creators tend to. So anyway, um, I guess I won't really waste too much of your time. I am currently doing full time full time content creation before I get my hygiene license, but also trying to see what it looks like when I'm doing full time content creation um, because in the future, who knows if that's what I'll be doing. Um, we don't know. So in the meantime, we're doing content full time and I'm loving every second of it. I love having to set my own schedule or getting to set my own schedule and getting myself up out of bed and like reminding myself the days where like I wanted nothing more than to be doing this. So um, now I'm really doing it. So here I am. I'm going to share my April favorites with you guys and I hope you enjoy. If you use any of these or have any of these, let me know in the comments below and let me know your thoughts. Okay. All right, so the first item that I'm gonna share with you guys is a hair product. So this is by the company Ceremonia, and it's actually a Latina-owned brand. This is what the bottle looks like. Um, and that's actually why I even gravitated towards it when I saw it in the store. I saw that it was a Latina-owned business, and I was like, why would I support a different business when I can support somebody in my own culture? And if I love the product, it's a double whammy. Um, I'm also realizing too, like, all these little like like products and stuff like they all look so cute and they have their own branding and stuff and I'm like it's really just like a tube with stickers on it like that's all really what branding is but isn't that wild anyway okay so this is a detangler and it's called the guava rescue spray I just love to smell it ah oh, it smells like my childhood if you're Latino Latina um and your mom used a detangler spray when you were a kid I bet you it smells exactly like this one. My, this smells identical to the one my mom used to use when I was a kid. She used to brush my hair when I'd get out of the shower uh, because I have very curly hair and as a kid I didn't want to deal with it and obviously if I didn't brush my own hair, it would turn into a rat's nest. So my mom would brush my hair for me as a kid because I'd never wanted to do it. And the hair, or the detangler that she used smells identical to this. So it's a UV and heat protectant detangler. So not only does it actually heat protect it also helps detangle your hair and it's very important so that you're not ripping your hair out of your head when it's wet because when your hair is wet that is when it's most vulnerable and i believe it's like free of silicones parabens yeah all those things so i love this stuff number one favorite or not number one but the first one next favorite that i'm going to share with you guys is um kind of a silly favorite if you will so this come these come in a pack of three and um i discovered these when i actually started working in clinic and hygiene school and they are the outdoor voices crew socks so these ones um they say like doing things on the little feet so they come in a pack of three i just bought a new pack because i love them so much i wear them in clinic because we had to have like long socks with our scrubs and honestly when i work if i'm not wearing joggers i think i'll probably continue to wear tall socks just because i have them and i love them and they're comfortable maybe not in the super hot months but when it gets colder i'll for sure keep wearing them but i wear them also at night so i have a bunch of them because i sleep in crew socks if you're somebody who doesn't sleep in socks i can't i know that there's like two sides to that argument and i think that you're weird if you don't wear socks at night 
I'm sorry. Your your toes are just like in your sheets. That is disgusting. That is disgusting. No, put on some socks. I can't handle you. It just like ugh, makes my skin crawl. But I love these socks so much. They come in so many different colors and I can't suggest them enough. And they're very comfortable. Next item that I have. Okay, so this is a makeup item-ish. It's the Fenty Beauty Ice Gloss Balm. I think that's what it's called. Gloss Balm Ice, yeah, and Cold Hearted. So it's this one, it looks blue, you know exactly what I'm talking about. You've seen Miss Riri probably talk about it or use it or all the influencers. And I cannot get enough of this lip product currently. I love it so much. It looks blue, but it goes on clear. It is incredible, it smells like peppermint, like straight peppermint. Oh, I love it. And it does kind of have like that lip plumpy like feel, but it's not the same like as other lip plumpers. It's really not because I hate other lip plumpers. This is the only one that I will use. Like actual lip plumpers, I steal I steer clear of those. I don't go near those. I hate them. I hate the way they just make your like your lips itch for like hours. This one, it's like you're putting Vicks Vapor Rub on your lips. So it's there, the feeling is there for like 10 seconds and then it's gone. But this makes your lips look so glossy you guys it makes your lips look wet like wet i'm not even lying i love it so much it stays on for so long actually rihanna literally said she created it because she wanted women's lips to look women's lips to look more wet so that boys wanted to kiss them more that's literally why she created this and miss girl let me just say you did your job with me. Um, okay, so anyway, that's that on that one. I love it, go purchase it, it's everything to me. There's not another lip product that I have that does what this one does. Um, okay, next item. Okay, so this one is an item that I get constant questions on like in real life. When I wear these, everybody's asking me where they're from, everyone's asking me where I got them, um, everyone's telling me they're so cute, and they are these aviator sunglasses from Amazon. It's these, okay? So it's really giving like 70s realness. It's really giving like Daisy Jones and the Six. And if you haven't watched that TV show, well actually let me backtrack. If you haven't read that book, you're gonna need to go read it because it is incredible. So not only do I have these ones, they're like the green frames with the brown um, lenses. I have these and I have three other shades because when I bought them, they got a little bit of a price like $14. But when I bought these originally, they were $11 on Amazon. So they were really cheapo and um, or really affordable, I should say. And those sunglasses look good on everybody. I absolutely adore them. And everyone asks me where I get them. Like literally I wear them and people are like, where'd you get those? wear those from because they're really cute and also like i'd rather spend money on sunglasses like these than spend dollars on or spend money on a 300 hundred dollar pair that i know that i'm going to break and lose i mean like do i have nice sunglasses yes i absolutely do have nice sunglasses that i've splurged on over the years but for my day-to-day -day wear it's gonna be these guys because if i break them i'm not gonna feel bad about it or if i lose them i won't feel bad about it and then like my nice ones i'll wear when i know that i'm going to behave like a normal human um, and that's not on that one. So my next item is the Octo Buddy. And if you're somebody who has, uh, follows people on Instagram, follows people on TikTok, follows people on YouTube, whatever it may be, I'm sure you've already heard of this. The Octo Buddy is like a little like thing that goes on the back of your phone case and these little things are suction cups, okay? So it will suction cup to literally any surface, obviously not my clothing, um, but it'll suction cup to nearly any surface and it really helps me personally film like my TikToks, it helps me film in the mirror, but also if you're somebody who likes to watch podcasts like in the morning when you're getting ready or if you like to watch YouTube in the morning when you're getting ready or whatever it may be or even if you like to listen to podcasts or listen to audiobooks I just put this up in front of me on the mirror and it just stays there and I can watch my videos I can listen to my audiobooks and I also can just like instead of having to like you know pick up the phone and reopen it every single time somebody texts me I just look at it respond and lock it it's so nice like sure this was made for content creators like 100% but it has everyday use as well and I believe they were like $11 I love this thing and also if you're somebody who has ADHD like me and you're a fidget spinner kid this really really feeds the ADHD in your brain just like feeling the suction cups all day I love it it's incredible get yourself an octo buddy love it okay so my last item that is the most important out of all of these items to me and I absolutely love and it's my one recommendation to you to go buy that is Happy Place by Emily Henry. You guys, I am not a book talker. I am not a book Instagram girly. I am not a book YouTuber. Like I'm not one of those people. But when I tell you 
this book wrecked me put me back together wrecked me again and then put me back together again oh my god i can't get past i can't get past like emily henry's reading or sorry writing i think she's becoming my favorite author so i've read two of her other books this is the third one and i'm gonna read the other one that i have left um i love it it is incredible it is everything i I just like I tell you the way she writes these characters more specifically the female characters and honestly like importantly also the way she writes male characters they're not just like the man who's gonna come and save the day and like the girls doing fine it is so good her characters are so complex her stories are like they just grab you like from the moment you start reading you're like I need to know the entire story right now it is so good it's it's for the people who have who have um that heart um who want to make their parents proud who um might have some people pleasing tendencies um people who are high achievers people who uh, want to be very successful in life but at the same time want to find somebody to share all of that success and love with in life and have a really hard time finding the balance that is who this book is for that is who this book is for this is an incredible book and I don't think everyone's meant to love it, but I think that a lot of people are meant to love it and I am one of them. It is so good. Do yourself a favor, okay? Just do yourself a favor and buy it. That's, that's that on that. Um, so, this is an honorable mention. My orange Stanley, although you guys know that I love my Stanley cups. Also, another honorable mention is getting my nails done again you guys know that i can finally get my nails done again because now i'm done with school um and i'm so happy about it and i went for like a fun pink color because i was like if i haven't been able to get my nails done in two years i'm gonna do a fun color right okay that was everything for the favorites video i hope you guys enjoyed that i hope you're having a good day and i hope something good happens to you after you watch this video don't forget to like and subscribe it really helps out my channel comment down below what you want to see for me next and that's it. I really value you watching this. Thank you for taking the time out of your day to join our little community community that we're building here. We're quirky, fun, and cute, okay? Okay, I love you guys, and I will see you next time. Bye! Yeah.